All right, Shalom Alaikum. First and foremost, I want to give all praise and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Yahusha, by Hashem Rakan Kodash. I want to give double honor to the apostles of the great millstone, Shalom to the elect that teach the word in our true people sincerity. And yeah, man, just a little quick lesson, man. I just want to go into the uh, the Lord don't change. And um, he's still that angry God of the Old Testament, man. Because you people truly believe that the Lord have, um, back then he was just an angry guy. And now he's accepting everyone. What you got to understand, Yahweh Bashem Yahushua is a terrible power, man. You know, and he and he sets up intricate, intricate, you know, plans and ways to kill people. Such as the word, uh, the TV show, A Thousand Ways to Die. Well, guess what? The real director behind that is Yahweh Bashem Yahushua, man. You know, let's see, uh, this is Hebrews 10 and 31. It says, um, it is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power. Yeah, man, because uh, the Lord Yahweh Bashmiel Shah comes up with different ways to kill people. You know, it's just not as simple as, you know what I mean, instant killing. You know, um, and it, it, it ain't, you know, um, as a matter of fact, just going on, uh, speaking on death, because um, that's like, this judgment. Let you know the Lord is um, it's, it's a terrible power, man. Let me get this quick precept to see. I think it's Proverbs 31. Let's see. Mm, let's see, so like, yeah, I can bear with me. Oh, it's, it's probably Proverbs 30 to see. Bear with me, Akim. If I can find his quick precept. Ah, yeah, Khan, this is, um, this is, um, Proverbs 30 and verse 15, it says, The horse lash have two daughters, cry and give, give. And then this is the point right here. It says, There are three things that are never satisfied. Yeah, four things say not it is enough. So things, these three things that um, that Solomon is going to tell you, that are never satisfied. And it says, verse 16, it says, The grave. So, death, man. You see what I'm saying? And who's behind it? Yeah, how about Shemi Abishai, man? You know, it says, In the barren room, womb, the earth that, that is not filled with water, and the fire that saith not, it is enough. So, hey, the fire, man. Was that's going to be the um, icing on the cake of America, man? Those therm That thermonuclear fire, man. You know, but getting back on the... um. The terribleness and the fear of your how about Shemiah Shah because that's what he he gives off, man. You know, if you if you really know how he get down, you know, because uh, just look at the words, man. You know, matter of fact, see this um since John yeah John twelve. 28 it says father glorify thy name then came there a voice from heaven saying i have both glorified it and will glorify it again so yeah and how did the lord do that by by um on the way of egypt man through egypt man you go to on the romans the ninth chapter it tells you he set up pharaoh to show his power man so that lets you know that is he, you, 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 not on. We're not on the level. You how about some outside, man? And we got to stay in fear and trembling because even the angels are, are, are tremble in front of you. How about some outside, man? Let me get that. Matter of fact, because hey, man, people, these niggas really is um is overlooking this, man. You know, let's see, um. The second Ezra chapter eight, 
I'm going to start at uh, verse 20. It says, O Lord, thou that dwellest in everlastingness, which beholdest from above the things in the heaven and in the air, whose throne is inestimable, whose glory may not be comprehended, but for whom the host of angels stand with trembling. And yeah, it, it takes one angel to, to destroy the earth, man. They got all that power, which it comes from you, how about some hours, huh? You know, but hey, they, they stand in trembling in front of the Lord, man. You know, so you think that the, that, 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 uh, the Lord just, he's just that soft guy now. The angels are slacking now. No, man. The Lord don't change. He, he you know, because it, it, it you know that's that's um that's 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 reneging, man. The Lord he he goes by his word, you know. Let's see this is Malachi three and six. It says, um, if I'm the Lord, I change not. And yeah, because if he if he did, man, well I mean, you know, Israel be done with, done away with, man. And why it says, Therefore you sons of Jacob are not consumed, yeah, because we 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 we'll, we'll all be dead right now, man. You know, but but he had, he um he he a man of his word, man. He's a man of his word, though, man. So that's why you know why we're still here. But the thing is, he 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 don't change, man. He's still that that terrible power, man. You know, he he he's the he's the uh the. He he murdered anyone that ever died. Guess what? It was from you. How about me outside? It was his say so, man. Whether it was so called natural causes or whatever the case may be, it was the Lord that that uh matter of fact, let me just get it. I know uh is the scripture explaining better than me, man. This on first first Samuel two and um uh, verse six, the Lord killeth and he, and make up alive. And bring it down to the grave and bring it up. So yeah, that's that point blank um period. That's that's the Lord behind all that, man. You know, that's why it's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of living power. Because once you get on the Lord bad side, man, you know that, that that's 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 something that you don't want to be in, man. Because guess what? You don't even know that you are in that trouble, man. That's the point of always um Meditating on it, man, and always fearing, man, because I know the scripture tells uh, uh, says that it's one step between me and death. Well, yeah, man, because it, hey, man, the Lord, you can wake up one morning, because scripture tells you that um, the Lord put the uh, your your uh, instructions while you're asleep. You know, you might wake up the next morning, think you're gonna do this and gonna do that. You might take the wrong turn away day one day and it's a, a down eighteen wheel right there waiting on you, man. You just don't know. You see what I'm saying? So that's why you gotta always constantly fear your how about see me out shot, man. You gotta constantly understand his terribleness. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Let's see, uh matter of fact, this is Isaiah 33 and verse 6. It says, and wisdom and knowledge shall be the stability of thy times. And strength of salvation. Yeah, so there's knowledge of Yahweh by Shemi Al-Shai. And what's part of that knowledge? Knowing that he's behind the scenes of everything, man. You know, it says the fear of the Lord is his treasure. So, hey, man, that's why, we, you know, you, you pray. Hey, man, that's begging, man. Asking for mercy, man. That's, that's the fear. That's that's our treasure, man. Because that's what the Lord, he, 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 he uh, um. This what he's expect for us to fear him, man. To know that um, that he's in control. That's that was the point of uh, him setting up Egypt, man, to show you that he he he's the he's the guy. You know. Let's see. Uh, go back to that Malachi. Cause I'm not saying some terribleness. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, this oh Jeffrey, yeah, kind. Of, this is um Malachi one and fourteen said, but curse be the deceiver, which have in his flock a male and vows and sacrifice unto the Lord a corrupt thing, 
For I am a great king, said the Lord of hosts, and my name is dreadful among the heathen. So why is that, man? Because number one, that's uh, they are the enemies of Israel, man. So guess what? They are the enemies of your how about Shimei outside, man. But guess what? The Lord have set that up like that. His nickname is Alasaja, which means uh, terrible, terrible demon power, man. Terrible power, man. You know. So hey, like you know, the lesson was really because I I I seen I uh, read over where the angels were standing and trembling. That's what made me jump on this lesson because how can the angels tremble before the Lord? But you people don't, man. You people don't uh, tremble at this message. People don't uh, consider that all hell is about to break loose pretty soon, man. You know, because it, 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 it was a point where people did tremble at this message, man. You know, this first Samuel 16 and 4, it says, And Samuel did that which the Lord spake and came to Bethlehem, and the elders of the town trembled at his coming and said, Come is that peaceably? Yeah, because they know that Samuel was a, a prophet of Yahweh by Shimei Awashai, man. And you coming under the banner of Yahweh by Shimei Awashai, nine times out of ten, it's bad news. <laughs> and that's the point, man. Scripture tell you it was written within the whole the role was written within and without the lamentations, mourners, and woe. So that lets you know, man, that we're this it's not what you want to hear. But guess what's gonna to come to pass, man? You know? It, it 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 they they trembled it because they was um uh, troubled with fear, man. With fear, you know what I mean? Because they understand the uh how you how about some outside get down man he, when he show his power man he do it dramatically he's just not gonna come down well he's gonna come down and crack the skies pretty soon but he he wasn't gonna come down and here I am my child and 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 spring a flower out of his hand to show you that he's the most high no he he this is how he do it man through 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 uh, lamentations mourners and woe. When he set a kingdom on high and he destroyed it, man. First through the words. And then he and then he act on it, man. You know. But yeah, I can manage this hope that will edify to the next time I want to say shalom.